For you stat and number lovers out there, I'm going to post up some open VR benchmark results as I usually do when I get a new headset or in this case a new graphics card. These results are really more for interest or perhaps to compare to your own open VR benchmark results. They don't necessarily translate to the performance increase you'll get in game. For that you can have a look at my last video. I do a couple of real world comparisons between the 49 and 5090 in VR on AMS2 and Flight Sim 2024. Anyway, today we're going to be having a look at the Quest 3 running on virtual desktop on the godlike resolution and then the Pimax Crystal and its medium resolution setting in the software and then it's high and it's in the high that we're going to expect to see the biggest um, percentage increase. Anyway, enough waffle, let's jump into the numbers. So first up is the Quest 3 godlike on virtual desktop on the 4090 with a 53.86 I've captured that whole little screenshot each time just so you can compare the left column and right column and see that the specs of the same resolution is the same between the 4090 and 5090 test anyway 53.86 we move on to the 5090 and we get 91.24 FPS which is a beautiful jump of 69% nice okay so Pimax Crystal next just on resolution quality of medium in a Pimax software, we're getting 39.58 FPS. On the 4090, jumping on the 5090, 76.25, which is a jump of 92%. So as we say, the higher the resolution, the higher percentage increase we expect. So finally, moving on to crystal on high. So, a low there, 15.78 to be expected on such a high resolution on a benchmark. And then moving on to the 5090, a whopping 39.57, which is a humongous boost of 150%. Anyway, there it is. Who doesn't love a screen full of benchmark results? Any comments or questions, drop below and I'll always try to answer. Otherwise, that'll do it for now and I'll catch you later. Cheers.